Let's go bully some monsters and get some stamps. Let's do it. 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 Bully some monsters. Get some stamps. Hmm. I'll say it's the one where I'm in the snow. What was I doing again? I was doing... I was gonna get some eggs, right? I got some Thunderbird eggs. Looking extra cute today. Well, thank you, thank you. You too. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. I'm ready to uh, get the party started and go slaughter some monsters because they... Um... Reminded their own business and yeah, <laughs> poor guys. Just minded their own business. I slaughtered them. <laughs> They're so mean. And so cruel. Oh yeah, I was gonna get some eggs, right? I guess. 10 Thunderbird eggs on the snow peak. Uh, <clears throat> do I have to fight a boss to do that? Maybe. Possibly. Ow. Ah. Pro, they called Chloe Bean names. Wah! Okay, those monsters are going down now. Those monsters are going down. Going down. Going down. Burned to death. Okay, okay. Ah! It's cold. Oh well, well, well. It's the icy place, right? We got, we got, we got to have the icy outfit. Hmm. Usually I do that, but I can't do that. Oh, that actually still worked. Why? Ah! Her magic's too OP, man. Kind of surprised that uh, magical girl hasn't joined the party. But maybe two magic users would be too powerful. I would never do anything else. Two eggs right there. I thought we were gonna find the nest and then fight the mama bird as like a big boss or something. I'm just picking them up off the ground though.
Why are there just Thunderbird eggs on the ground? They're supposed to be in a nest. How are they supposed to live and grow up if they're just on the ground? here near the boss that may or may not spawn. It didn't spawn last time I walked through here, but maybe it's recovered by now. Oh. That eruption isn't stopping anytime soon. Probably not a good idea to go any further for now. Huh. Okay. Interesting. But I already got all my bird eggs. Am I supposed to go back, huh? Did I miss one? Or am I supposed to exit and reload the area and get more? Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. I guess I'm supposed to exit the area and come back. I've only gotten six. That'll take two runs through run throughs to get the ten. How dare that! Not everything will spawn back to life. But so will the drops. The drops will be there too. Got our ten thunder bird eggs. Ah, I keep dashing backwards. Gonna give me time to charge my magic, huh? Take that! Take that! Might as well run through and get get my extra supplies anyway. It's around getting extra Thunderbird eggs. I might need them for some recipe or something. Or I might need this other stuff. 
Games like this turn you into a compulsive hoarder. I must get all the items. need anybody else for it's got magic lady I'll tell anybody else although uh, CJ has the best movement but Isha's definitely got the best or the strongest attack I am that AOE too look out both of them our Thunderbird eggs to the farm! We're gonna start an egg farming business. Are we sure this game isn't like Stardew Valley or something? We're even farming, Matt. Hmm. Oh, okay. She but unlocked Meat Master. Obtained max grade meat. Why is max guy the dot? I, suppose, I guess it's an abbreviation for maximum, but max is a perfectly good word. You don't need the period. Got some exquisite meat. Gently now, gently. Don't break them. How about we get you a stamp? You three really helped me out today. Leave the rest to me. I'll keep these eggs warm till they hatch into glorious thunderbirds. We'll take the rest to the end to do a few test runs then. I mean... Are we making it tell delicacy at the end? Okay. I was about to say, I don't know anything about raising thunderbirds, but I guess we're just cooking them. We've determined the, 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 which ones have, uh, uh, you know, a uh, bird in them. Which ones don't, apparently. Construction of the pasturage is complete. New stock. Whoa. Farm egg. Yeah, you mean Thunderbird egg.
Ah, there's really no quest. What? There's like zero quest besides the main story. What's going on around here? This can't be right. Right, the inn, right now, the tavern. Do, 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 do. Giant stone. Have I even seen that one? I don't know. I don't think I've seen that in my, that before. Wait, I have one though, don't I? Oh, apparently I have enough. I've never seen Mithril though. Wonder where that is. It's probably a rare mine drop in the uh, lava place, but I guess. Doo -doo. Doo Charge jumps. Hold the jump button for longer to charge a powerful gravity defying jump. With this skill, Garo can explore more areas than before. Wait, Garo doing a big jump? That's hard to believe, but okay. I'll have to try it. Hi, Rajiv. How's our bathhouse going? Or doing that. Not going. Well, same same meaning, Kate. Totally. Couldn't be better. Even if even if I do say so myself. <laughs> I do wish the Venturers would stop drinking before they bathe, though. Bit of a pain trying to keep an eye on them. I really could do with a good soak myself. Anyway, we need you to boil these eggs in that fabulous bath of yours. Then smoke them in their shell for a bit, too. Till they're dark as the day is long. If I'm not mistaken, these are Thunderbird eggs. Will these cook in the hot springs? That's what we'd like to find out. Consider it a test run. If it works, we'll be selling them as souvenirs. We've already built a pen for keeping Thunderbirds up on Mermilla's pasturage. What a brilliant idea! Smoked Thunderbird eggs would make great bar snacks. I reckon the Venturers would love them. You leave the rest to Rajiv. Come back in two days and I'll have these ready for you. If we're keeping them in the shell, might as well smoke them for two days rather than one. It. We'll be back in two days then. Thanks, Rajiv. Hmm. Damn, that was fast. Two days. Step right up. Get your smoked hot spring black Thunderbird eggs right here. Whoa, they really are black and glistening, just like Squash said. You sure this ain't burned, mate? They look more palatable out of their shells, I think. What do you want to call them? Call them? Like a name? Smoked hot spring black thunderbird eggs is a bit of a mouthful, no? Something simpler would be nice. Hmm. Shiny black eggs. I could, sh I could decide what to call the eggs. Yeah, we should call it CJ's, right? Pro eggs? Dang. I don't, I don't know if pro is an option. You can only choose from the list. You can't type in your own thing. Oh, I don't think that pro's an option. Dang. What you call it that and be like, Onsen Eggs Black Eggs. Like, what kind of name is that? Weird, right? Super cool. There we go. Super cool. That's like that. That's like a, a synonym for pro, right? Hmm. 
There we go, there we go. Super cool black eggs, huh? Sounds good to me. But do they taste as good as they sound? That's the real question. Who's gonna try it first? Go ahead, Guru! You've earned it! Wouldn't dream of it, mate. Ladies first. Isha? M maybe the elders deserve to try the very first batch. They're close enough to death anyway, I guess. Feeling vengeful, are we? Perish the thought! It'll take some time to mass produce them. I j just thought it'd be nice to give them a t tasting. They did seem pretty excited about the idea. They're in the plaza, right? Let's go see what they think. Cat eggs sound good. They'd be like, wait, what? But cats are mammals. What the heck? Never on those super cool black eggs is the best. Time to win over the old crowd. Hey everyone, have I got a surprise for you. Feast your eyes on new Nevaeh's very own delicacy. Super cool black eggs. Oh, it's beautiful. A wonderful souvenir for our town. Well, go ahead. Take a bite. They're like, oh, is it gonna work? Well, it's good. Very good, in fact. The yolk has a strange spicy aftertaste. This is better than any other hot spring egg I've ever had. We've got a hit for sure. Come on, Shiva. Try one. Take a bite at least. Hm. I'm not so as easily pleased as you are. Oh, shush. Just eat it, will you? Hum. Uh, are you okay? Do you need some water? It's good. I feel ten years younger. It really does add time to your life. You did good. On behalf of the other townsfolk, you have my thanks. Let me get you a stamp. Where did I put that thing? I'll take care of it. That was the best egg I've ever eaten, you know. If Doxa really is down in the barrows... And you can bring him back? I'd like to share this with him. But thank you, Shiva. So, go on. Go get him. Well, one more thing ticked off the list, eh? Indeed. Now we can explore the barrows at our leisure. Well then, what are we waiting for? That humongous lens and Isha's dad aren't going to find themselves, are they? To the barrows! Does that mean that the volcano's done erupting now? Woohoo! In quest 26, deeper into the ruins. Woohoo! But first, there's about 25 quests, right? I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! Second Street, Rune Corridor, Pasturage. Looks like I can do the Pasturage one right now. More quests! More quests! More quests! More quests! More quests! There's not all such thing as two fuel quests. We need more. More. How's the factory going, Armilla? 
really well. So fat well, in fact, that I'm thinking about adding to my product line. I'm thinking ham could be a big seller around here. It definitely would. I'd buy it even if no one else did. In that case, I suppose you wouldn't mind helping out? I'll need a lot of stuff to make this happen. Leave it to me. Um, uh, uh, I've already got the ore. Why do you need ore for pigs? To make the pig pen, maybe? Got everything you asked for, I think. Thank you. I'll get straight to work. Right after I stamp that card for you, of course. Yeah. Oh, we got Thunderbird eggs. This is the egg, but with some zap. Zap. We got ham now, too. Making me hungry. It's not snacky time yet, though. This one's kind of catchy too. I gotta say I preferred the first uh, song that played the before it switched to Platinum, whatever the other one was. The other ones are over here somewhere. I think it's Second Street and Rune Quarter, but we'll check out the places. Yeah, they need stuff that's only in the runes. TJ, found you. Do you need something, Frida? Well, I've been thinking I'd like to show off more of my armor, but I don't really have much space. So I've decided to redecorate. More goods hung up over here, some extra storage there. If it's materials you need, just say the word. Reliable as ever. Don't keep me waiting too long now. Hardwood in the Great Forest. Actually, don't have it. This place will look so much better with fancy armor draped all over the walls. Oh, yeah. Wow. Wonder where I get hardwood from. Hmm. Maybe it's a rare drop in the later sections of the map. Jay, I've heard you I heard you've been super deep into the barrows. Yep, I have a feeling I'm closing in on the real good treasure now. Well, I've learned that my book, which you returned to me, was very likely based on an ancient text which may be in the barrows. From what I can tell, the text is really more of a stone slab. Can you read the stuff carved into those stone slabs? I'm afraid I can't, but that text seems to be hiding some secrets. Okay, okay, I'll see. If I see it, I'll bring it back for you. Find stone slabs in the rune barrows? I would very much like to know about the secrets of the runes. Uh, didn't we do that quest before, pretty much? And it was like one of those mage guys that held it. Good day, Miss Isha. Miss, Miss, Miss Isha, Miss Isha, Miss Isha, that's like tongue twister. Miss Isha, Miss Isha, Miss Isha. Good day, Miss Isha. Good day, George. Have you learned anything from researching my clothes? Nothing concrete, I'm afraid. Although I suspect a connection to the force field surrounding the town. To that end, I fear I must once again ask for your assistance. Pinpa! 
Alpa. Alpa. Elaborate. I should like to know about your first time. My fir first time? Not, not, not the What's the matter with you, George? Oh, goodness. No, no. Her first time using magic. Might you possibly have in your possession an item left behind from your first experience with your abilities? With that, I believe I might be able to shed some light on your situation. Please take care how you speak, George. But, yes, I see. You do? CJ! We must return to my assistant at once. Alright, back to the town office, I suppose. Research, you have my word. Hey, Malore, I'm surprised you never joined my party. I think it's unlikely to happen by this point. Two magic users is too much. Two too many. One too many? Hmm. Hardwood lumber, huh? For that. JJ, just in time. Just in time for what? I messed up big. A customer. I meant to give them a defense potion, but I wasn't paying attention. Let them leave with an attack potion instead. <gasps> you did what? But if they go somewhere dangerous thinking their defense has been boosted. I did say I messed up big, didn't I? I have to catch up to them. What did they look like? He was a young man. But he gave me the feeling he'd lived here for a while. More green, if I recall correctly. Got it. I'll go look for him. Here, if you see him, give him this defense potion. Please find him quickly. There's no time to waste. Hello? Are you over here? No? Hello, someone wearing green. There's nobody around here wearing green. No green. Hmm. Maybe in the rune quarter, but they're probably more likely to be out here. Need defense potion for me? I bet you do. That's what was happening. I was going though. How you doing tonight? Hello again. Do you happen to remember anything of the first time I used my magic? Oh, well. Rumors of your habits were already circulating when I began my service here, Miss Mayor. Habits? Ah, uh, I m misspoke. Please excuse me. Habits? As in, she was using magic without realizing it? <sighs> the search might be a lost cause without your old man around to help. Not quite. We can ask the housekeeper. Marvelous idea, Miss Mayor. She's probably at your residence as we speak. She has served our family for many years now. She might remember something useful. So we're going to your place then, are we? Off we go! It's probably this way. It's going, it's going, huh? That's good, 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 good. Going is pretty good. Oh, Miss Isha, you're home quite early today. I won't be staying long, Sanvi. I was wondering if you happen to remember anything about the first time I used magic. 
The first time you used your powers. I've waited so long for you to ask. Are, are you crying? I remember it well. You were still so very small. I was doing my nightly rounds, turning out the lights. You said, I'm not sleepy. And without warning, the sconce burst into flames. Your father was also rather astounded. I have kept that memory close to my heart for the longest time. I even still have the sconce, or what's left of it. Bingo. Isha must have been so cute when she was a baby. CJ! Could I trouble you to deliver that sconce to the Lens Forge in the Rune Quarter, Sanbi? Very good, Miss Isha. Wait, if I have to go report to George anyway, why why don't I just deliver the sconce myself? Yeah! Well, I'm glad to hear it's going. That sounds better than not going to me. At least to me it does. Maybe I'm biased though. Where would the green person be? No other ones there right now. Green person's probably on their way to the forest. You guess. I could tell you you're like, man, why is she not doing Neptune and I? How dare this game be leaving Game Pass? Hmm. I was expecting the green person to be out here. Oh my oh, maybe it's this guy. Hey! You! Over there! Wait! Me? I'm kind of in a rush, lady. I've just downed a defense potion, so I've got to go fight the ogre in the great forest before it wears off. No! No, 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 no! Listen, what happened is... What? Really? Yikes. Here! I brought this defense potion for you. That's terrifying. We found the green guy. Exciting. You gonna go fight the big ogre by himself? What does he think he is? The main character? song slowly growing on me. It's slowly growing on me. I prefer the other one though. The other one's better. <sighs> that was close. I owe you, CJ. I owe you big. How about a stamp? How about fucking 10 stamps, you stingy piece of shit? Oh, level 5 healing potion? What is that, though? Really only... What? I can't sell it at the purchase prices. 3,000 HP? That's kind of overkill, don't you think? First Thunderbird eggs? That's definitely overkill. How are you, Twitch TV streamer Freelia? I'm doing pretty well today. It's a nice Tuesday. All right, we're gonna give you this. And you're not gonna say anything weird. Did you happen to get a delivery of a busted up sconce? I believe it to be the only remnant of my first time using magic. I did indeed. So that's what that was. I shall begin my research at once. 
But first, allow me to stamp your card. New stock. Looks like the same stock as before. It's possible level 3 one pops up now. If I upgrade. But why would I? Why would I upgrade? Mm, hardwood lumber in the great forest. Aww. Another stone slab needs finding. Didn't I do that quest literally yesterday? But now I need another one. What? Cool. God damn it. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. Oh, I'm looking for what exactly? Hardwood. Lumber. Where that be? Where that be? Arch of the Lava Ruins, my main quest. I guess it's done erupting. I feel like hardwood lumber would be late in the map, right? Maybe. run over there and there's gonna be some hardwood Lightweight lumber there. Hmm. Hmm. There's hardwood. I 
still just lightweight lumber. Hmm. Where's the hardwood specifically? Maybe it requires me to get it as a rare drop? Tainted hardwood lumber is a drop on the ground here. Oh wow, that gives you 4,000 every time. What the fuck? Oh, is it only a drop on the ground though? I guess so. It's kind of a pain to get then. I have to go like to the end every time. A murder a bajillion things to get here. So the 4,000 Bakwa pots do respawn though. I hadn't tested that yet. Well, that's intriguing. Oh, see, I see. But you don't see. Oh, maybe I do. Maybe I do. This is a long run back to the thing. Maybe I'd be better off doing the fishing spot and taking the shortcut down. I'll try that route on the next run. the great tree glade we'd have to fight the boss although that'd take about five seconds but still i'll try this one through the door let me go down Oh, I got hardwood lumber from there, too. Oh, that's intriguing. Wild bird You can get it from these trees. Just like you can get huge or, or high purity ore from the other places. Oh. It's not wolves. Ok. 
Okay. 3,000 buck. Well, that's, um... I didn't get any hardwood lumber on the ground. I bet I don't when I get the, uh, the, the bandits. If only I did. If only, huh? That probably is faster, though. We all know the other trees are only gonna give me lightweight lumber. What's going with that? What's up? Never mind. I knew it. I knew it. This right here kind of reminds me of Okami. So it almost... Uh, uh, you were just thinking? Oh, what were you thinking about? I wonder if that one always gives me hardwood. Maybe. Just thinking, I'll support my guess what you said. I bet you were thinking about that. I bet you have an active imagination. This is the best one to farm for the pots or not. It's fairly quick. On the quarry might be a bit closer though. What does that mean? Powerful tease. I'm just teasing you. <laughs> I will flow. What? You see? Good, 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 good. I appreciate you having eyeballs. That can see. That's always nice. I think I've got everything you asked for. Of course you do. You haven't let me down yet. Didn't expect you to start now. I'd love to fill this card up for you, but one stamp will do, right? Fuck you, bitch. I suppose it will. Fuck you, bitch. Fill that card up right now. You can't you can't mention it and then not do it. It's just cruelty. Cruelty. I'm 
Construction of the armor shop is complete. Ooh. That's great. Blob of stuff. I'm not spending 10k on that. Not at this point, anyway. They all need stuff from the lava ruins. Oh, right. Forgot about that one. Go back to the lava ruins now. No, you don't see. <gasps> Wait, so you just walk around like this all the time? Bumping into everything? I'm so sad. There's no more new side quests to do. I just did them all. Except for the one that I haven't fulfilled yet, anyway. Tragic. Did I forget you said anything? <gasps> I'm writing it down right now. You're not to pick up your free farm stuff just sitting in the road. Where in the rune bearers would this lab be? What the, will the map tell me? Nope. It could be like anywhere. We just have to run through it looking for a uh, slab. Probably not back here, but... Think of some tasks for you, but your mind isn't working. Okay, okay. Maybe you should take a nap again. Maybe you need more nap power. Yeah, Gar supposedly has a charge jump or something. Ah, yeah. I guess it makes sense for a kangaroo to be able to jump. It's not really any better than her uh, double jump, though. You see how high that is? It's really not any higher than hers, so. Uh... You don't need a nap. Are you sure? I bet a nap sounds real good, though. Hmm. I don't think we'll run through snow peaks. There's no reason to. Do, 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 do. Go to the next part of barrels.
Oh, are you trying to get rid of me? Nah, I'm trying to do what's best for your uh, your midden, your mind. Okay, that's right, that's right. Uh, that means that means uh 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 I mean, uh, stuff, 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 stuff. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. It was delayed. We got, we got okay, we got, we're right. <coughs> no, 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 how oh, dare you question me? The first I hear, oh, but um, me being like, well, you know, he was questioning me, so I had to fix this. What's up? What's happening? How's it going, Mexican boy? How you doing tonight? You can't can't question my judgment. You can't question me. I am a pro, after all. You cannot question me. You question me sometimes. I can't believe this. I can't believe you'd question me. I can't believe you'd question me. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Hope you're doing well tonight, though. If I were a stone slab, would I be in the upper pass or the lower pass? I'd probably be in neither. Probably at Snow Peak. Or the last area. Hey, Ivor! What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Sometimes you do things that are questionable. Me? Do things that are questionable? Never. Never ever. This is the lower path. That's the dead end, right? But I suppose it's worth checking for the slab here. Ow, 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 ow. Hmm. That's a fishing spot, isn't it? That should be the fishing spot. I don't think a stone slab's gonna be in the fishing spot. Just a guess. You say so, bro? Whew. You weren't expecting to change to plum like that? What? Plum's amazing, isn't that? Look at it. It's very purple. It's very amazing. Very cool. Oh anyway, yeah, I'm super winning. I'm showing the game who's in charge around here. You can tell, right? You don't fish giant slabs of stone. Kind of weird if you do. If you don't. Or weird if I did. I'm looking for a stone slab for a quest.
It'll be easy to find. It's a quest item, so... Wherever it is will show up with, like, a blue marker. Once you get there, though, that doesn't show up on the map, so I don't know exactly where it is in here. Oh, it's right there! Hello, guys. Level 45. Got stone slab. Those guys are scary. That's the, uh, way back. Really hitting crits left and right. Yeah, they make sure you know you got a crit, because it's like, BIG CHECKS ON THE SCREEN! Make sure you don't miss it. Get out of here. We got our side quest item. Very proof of cool. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right, that's right. Gotta go give the lady her stone slab. And she'll be like, and you do ten more quests for me. No other quests right now. Find her. I don't even have to look, right? Let's go. Close my eyes. And go right. Very nice. Well, thank you, thank you, though. Very, very nice indeed. Elda, you think this is the stone slab you were looking for? Yes, that's it. A genuine stone slab from the Barrows. I can't believe I'm looking at one with my own two eyes. Here, CJ, take a stamp. You've earned it. Thank you, thank you. We're on level threes. What are we gonna do? Get level fives around here. Okay, I guess we gotta do main story now. We're all out of side quests. We can't upgrade anything without. Fire materials, so we have to go to the lava ruins and get some items to upgrade things. We have some money. We don't have enough money, but we got some money.
Hmm. You can't go anywhere in the lava rooms, but I would go at the beginning anyway because. Oh, uh, you know. I'd go to the beginning anyway because I need to farm the fire items to upgrade stuff. Will I have to fight the boss again? Let's see, let's see, let's see. He didn't spawn last time, but. The other ones do, so maybe he'll, maybe he's back now. Maybe he's had a vacation and he's back now. What's down? What's down is the ground. What's up, Sap? Now it's going Lou up. Whoa! There's lava everywhere! To be expected after an eruption, I guess. At least it's a little warmer now. I wonder if the burrows have been damaged. Only one way to find out. Watch your step, though. Nope, no boss this time either. I guess he's a one and done boss. Unlike the other ones. Not because the terrain changes. I'm just sick. How about you? Oh, no! I'm not sick. I hope you feel better soon. Meantime, I shall slaughter monsters. It looks different, but it doesn't look damaged. I was afraid part of it may have caved in, but it appears to have held up. Well, that's one less thing to worry about. What should we do now? Let's head for where we fought that huge lava monster. I definitely saw a man here behind it. I think we can go deeper down the barrows from there. Don't you be a lava monster as a boss? Well, I've already fought a lava monster. I fought a giant lava worm. And killed it. And then the... Whoop, and the volcano was getting ready to erupt. Ow. Hmm. What is I fire weak against again? Is it wind? I think it's wind. Doo, doo, doo. I guess I should have added some level elements here. I should stop being stingy. Go stop being stingy. I'll just teleport back here. <sighs> yeah, maybe as a brother. Oh no, that's what it is. He's got a bro. He's got a bro. He's got a bro. Saw me do level two rooms. Wait, and you'll do level three rooms. Just do it. Wind that's strong as fire. Me should put the lightning rune on. Uh, is Earth what's strong against fire? I got or uh, I don't. I, I don't have the Pokemon elements memorized yet. Sorry. Somewhere in, like the help section to go like halfway down. It's like there's an element thing. I don't got it memorized. And there's only like four elements. 
Let's say, uh, far strong against water. Wait, wind strong against far. Wouldn't that mean if I had lightning as a defense too, I wouldn't be take much damage? And I've got like two runes. Oh, where am I going? I'm on autopilot! I'm autopiloting! I'm just walking in the barrels. Go back to the lavas! I can go through the whole thing now, huh? I'm still going to warp to the beginning, though, because I need to farm fire materials. Ow. Is that down? Does that red arrow mean that they're weaker to me? Or, me, or I, I, I'm weaker than them? Which one is it? Which one is uh of job shot? Not sure which one it is. Oh. It's the other way around. Oh wait, water strong against far. But it did it say water strong against far? But it clearly did more damage. So the red means you do more damage. The blue means you do less damage. Why can't the element thing be, like, closer? Oh, we- Oh, each element has its own weakness. Yeah, I can't read. So wind is weak against fire. Fire is weak against water. Hmm. So I should have- Water equipped then, right? If fire's weak against water, then they wouldn't do as much damage either. I can't read. Although it's technically ice in this game, but it's considered the water element. Hmm, maybe she should just... Ice is her default. guys are extremely rude. You can't just attack people. Ah, it's stuck. Can't I just kick people? I mean, you can kick people if you want, but don't be surprised when they kick back. Be like, Ow! Why'd you kick me? Well, you started it! Yeah, we were looking for the right lens for this thing to see the hologram message. 
You believe this? Maybe it's time to do, use the last save slot. Is there a fifth one? Though we only got three. <gasps> what kind of RPG only has three save slots? My multiple saves, because you always do that in an RPG. What if you uh soft lock yourself? If you only have one save, you're fucked. Actually, I would have soft locked myself in uh, Final Fantasy uh, Tactics War of the Lions or whatever it was called. If I didn't have multiple saves, I would have fucked myself. There's been a few times I can think of where I would have been doomed if I didn't do multiple saves. I always have multiple saves in an RPG. You should always have multiple saves, period, honestly. In case something happens, you need to revert to the older one. It is a backup safety measure. Hello, by the way, Pyro. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? And it's possible I won't use them, but the whole point of them is to is is backup. Hmm. Need to equip a fire rune to open this thing. Still can't think of any tasks. Too busy trying to grow pumpkins on the farmlands and have no luck? Well, you're supposed to ask your pumpkins very politely. Please grow. Please, please grow. Please grow. Assurance, but not very confident in one's ability. Well, I mean, sometimes it's not even like your ability or whatever. It's just uh, the game fucking over. For Final Fantasy Tactics, I was too underleveled for that boss. And I tried for like two or, two hours or so to not be stuck in like a loop of death, but it didn't work out, so I had to revert to an older save. Level up like ten levels, and then it went and kicked his butt. Girl likes them just in case, in case she does something profil dumb. Oh my gosh. I would never do hello. Anything profile though. Ah. Ah. Myth roll. I need that for an upgrade. 5k. Ruby. We're in level 3. Nice. And keep that in mind. Good, 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 dope. Good, good, good. No way, it's all red and fiery here, isn't it? Will we be red and fiery? You just say you're trapped in the infant loop of death? Yeah, I was. I was not prepared for the boss. I was not prepared for that boss at all. And if I didn't have ba backups, older saves, or I had a save from like uh, maybe an hour before. If I didn't have that, I'd have been doomed.
It's a higher up one, I think. <clears throat> mm, I probably get this treasure chest now. There was like one over here somewhere. Ha 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 ha. Fragment ha. Huh? Ooh, 2k there. The trinkets are what you're getting there. It's not a bad room to farm in. You get the stuff from the boxes to sell to it. In the pots. I should grab truth card 18 out of 20. I changed your avatar again when you weren't looking. Yes. I did. That hurt. Fireballs hurt. How do I play? Is that to be? Yeah, is that to be or is that to you? That's to be. I play lots of things. Hey, big guy. Such as this amazing game, for example. I'm not that good at the chain link attack. I was trying to chain link for days and didn't work out. Ah, okay, okay. You like it, Dolby? Hooray! I have to go up and around, right? Ah! I'm burning. I'm gonna just burn. Oh, cool mithril.
Ah. Pearl jam is I do. Music people. I made songs. Let's see what to see. Ooh, day. Help you out a good time. Well, you did say you did. Hmm. Mexican boy. What was that? Whoa, 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 what's going on? Ah! It's kind of rude, don't you think? You just charge at people like that? It's kind of rude, don't you think? Will I play any instruments? I do not! Wait, I mean, I play a uh, plastic bottle. Yeah, I do plastic bottle. Totally, totally, totally. Properties! Uh, uh, that counts, right? I totally count. This is where we fought the lava boss monster. Will it be back for round two? It's not back for round two. Let's go. You're not expecting that. Oh. The lava ruins on foot achievement unlocked. Explored every area in the lava ruins. <laughs> Play euphonium. Oh, that's cool. That's like a that's like a 
tuba kind of thing, right? One of those uh, blowing instruments. That's cool. It's just something you like. It's true, it's true. Red Pearl. What do you mean? I I'm not red. You're imagining things. Holy. Oh, what we got? Whoa! Where are we now? It looks real different from before. Look alive, mate. The walls look ready to crumble. You sure you want to press on? The barrows live yet, it would appear. This area seems to be unchanged since before they were sealed. Before they were sealed, huh? Does that mean the treasure hasn't been disturbed either? It could mean that, yes. Yes! Celebrate. Untouched treasure. Chances like this don't come along, well, ever. Leave the trinkets behind, dummy. We're here for one thing and one thing only. That humongous lens. Right, because the rocks need treasure more than me, don't they? Don't make me laugh, mate. I'm taking all I can get. That's right, that's right. Where'd my lava go? Everything blue now. You know what this calls for? I, I, now we're back to blue. It's blue time. Remember depths? Oh, a whole new area, huh? Oh, what the hell is this thing? Lightning guys, huh? What's strong against lightning again? I don't know. Earth, probably? Am I, I've already forgot. Am I looking for the blue up or the red down? I've already forgot which one I'm looking for. Oh, lightning's what they are. Well, blah, 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 blah. I already forgot. I gotta check you. I thought they were finished with Spy Chameleon. You think so? Oh, they come out whenever they want. Okay, these guys are lightning. So they're technically wind category. Wind is, is weak against fire. Okay, okay. You want the blue up arrows. I start blending up the background. Freely a help. Although, what happened, Dolby? What happened? I should uh, put one on Isha, too. I don't really care what Garu's got, because I gotta be honest, I don't really use him. He's got fire on right now as well. Get up there. What? She just launched this down. Look right, turn in Albuquerque and ended up in a deep, ca deep cave of magma. I don't know the way out. Uh oh. -uh. That sounds dangerous. Ah! Ah! I just I fall go backwards whenever I take the, the damage. Or a calcum is received. 
You'll know your way out of the lava ruins. I can't believe this. Danger step that map. Yeah, I got you covered, man. I'll say if you if you if you just take some notes here, you'll get out of this place. It'll be easy. You just, you just gotta copy this map, and then you can't escape. That's right. That's right. You're the coolest cat around, not the sneakiest chameleon, probably around. I guess I can't argue with that. I can't argue with that. You got a point there. Thank you, take this. Oh, thank you for the stamp. My card should be pretty close to filled now. Beep, 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 beep. These guys didn't respond. Calcum received. Is that saying Rune Bear Adepts in the background? Whoa, what the hell is this place? Whoa! I've never seen anything like this before! What do you think this is? Doesn't look very useful, does it? These books are practically relics. Is this the old script? Strange gizmos, stranger books, and massive sigils. No doubt about it. This is the Sorcerer's Lab. That humongous lens is here somewhere. I'm sure of it. Well, where is it then? Look, another device. She's right. Let's take a look, Guru. Up you go, mate. Combine! Wait, why are we combining? You're getting along too well. The runes on this match the ones on Malor's rune lens. This'll fit for sure. What will it show us this time? There he is, the sorcerer. Well, I don't understand that. Language, sorry. Now well, then, how did we do? <laughs> it worked. It actually worked. The raw lens transmutation was a success. Can't do much with a lens of this quality, though. So this one didn't have enough power to crystallize anything good. That's it. The amount of magical power in the subject influences the grade of the lens produced. If I use a more powerful creature and allow it ample time... <laughs> well, uh, this guy doesn't seem very friendly. Incredible! He could create raw lenses? <laughs> Incredible isn't the word I'd use for a teeny tiny lens like that. 
think, Guru. If we could use that magic, we could make as many lenses as we want. You heard him. The bigger the subject, the bigger the lens. You think you can learn how to do it from these books and devices? Of course I can't. I don't read the old script, do I? Can't use magic either. Besides, magic can only be used by someone special enough to get chosen by a rune lens. Or... I'd be like, stare at Isha and be like, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> You're a wizard, Harry. I'd be mean, Profilia. Where's my magic wand, then? What? Oh, I was just wondering if someone who was born with magic might be able to replicate the sorcerer's method. Someone like... No, I cannot. Nor can I read the old script. I haven't the slightest notion what that old man was chanting. No good, huh? Well, looks like we came up short again. So close and yet so far. Speak for yourself. There's plenty of places left to explore down here. That humongous lens is around somewhere and I'm not leaving without it. Suppose you're right. We'd best get a move on then if we're going to search every inch of this place. Right. Isha, are you alright? You've been staring off into space for a while. Oh. Yes, I'm fine. First X to doubt. Search the rune burrows. I'm pressing X to doubt right now. Wah! Fix that. Ugh. Nope, I'm out. I'm leaving. I refuse. I can't fight those. They can't do that to me. I'm just kidding. What? A rune golem. And that other guy. What the fuck? Tough guys at once? I can't believe you guys. Or Auric Halcom. Ugh. I'm kind of frozen. Every type of slime at once, huh? Every type of thing at once. They don't want me over here, man. That's finally it. That was a lot of dudes. I've never had so many guys for one thing. Wait, I want the chest. How dare you have cutscenes? 
Ho ho! These look just like the runes on the machine back at the volcano. What's it doing all the way over here then? Do you think someone removed it from the device and brought it here? You said it yourself. We're likely the first ones to make it this far in. Definitely the first adventurers, anyway. So who then? Ancients? That sorcerer himself? Or my father, possibly. No way of knowing for sure. Why it's here doesn't really matter much anyway. It's what it's gonna show us that's important. Isha? You look pale. No, I'm fine. Really. Are we heading back to the volcano then? Let's do that. We might get a hint as to where that humongous lens is hiding after all. I would say that humongous lens is down that hallway right there. That it won't let me go down. In quest 27, the truth in the tale. Uh-oh, we're gonna find out the truth, huh? No ma. No ma. Hey, Jaina. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? You love restless legs. Please save me. Oh, I'm not a doctor and I will not chop off your legs. I refuse. Lily, your legs need to um, exercise or something. Hold on. I don't know if that helps or not. Go run for five miles and come back and report how your legs are feeling. Holy. They should be super tired by then and ready to sleep. Hmm, that probably looks like it could go somewhere too. That one probably won't go anywhere though. Hmm. Oh, it's all the way back there. I see. These monsters better watch out. Wait, I already like, killed everything on my way here, didn't I? Thank you. Ha ha, Gina. Hope you're doing well, aside from your legs that don't want to nap. My pug lover, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? Wait, it's this way. Hmm, that's a dead end though. This way. Playing Dead by Daylight for like a month. Ooh, that's cool. Down here. Oh, and all those uh, monsters who's in charge around here. Our survivors, if you've been doing killer side. I'm in charge around here. Hey, don't you throw me on the hook. How dare you? 
Both. All right. All right. Well, here we are. Well, so let's find out the truth, shall we? Karu, same as usual, if you don't mind. Like I've got a choice. Be a bit more ladylike coming down this time, though. No promises. Get. Yep, these are a set, all right. This should fit. Show us your wisdom, oh great mysterious gizmo. It's starting! Uh, rip those people. Oh, how dare you! Pathetic mortals! Cattle! All of you! Man with azure hair. Hmm. Hmm. Azure. What color's azure? Hmm. It's blue! Why? Wait, who who here has blue hair? Aside from me, of course. Isha. Hmm. I wonder. Maybe she's a descendant, huh? <sighs> oh yeah. Must be pretty humiliating to get beaten by our hands, then. You call us cattle? I'll stop you. Rawr! Uh-oh. Thanks. Ah! Or sure's toast. The people of Nevea will suffer no more. legend was true. The sorcerer was sealed away down here. The seals were broken, though. Should we be scared? These visions are from hundreds of years back, right? I doubt that old geezer's soul has hung around this long. Are you sure you're okay, Isha? Did you notice? Those who sealed the sorcerer had the same hair color as me. He said the people of Nevea, didn't he? The ancestors of the townsfolk. Same hair color as Isha here. New Nevea was formed when our ancestors settled on the abandoned town of Old Nevea. There should not be any blood ties between us. Coincidence? The only citizen of New Nevea with azure hair is me. No one else can use magic either. The monsters used in the sorcerer's transmutation experiments also had azure hair when he was done with them. Is it possible he ran the same experiments on the people of old Nevea? And that's why they sealed him away? But... That would mean I'm... Hey, hey, slow down, mate. You're overthinking this. Ain't that right, CJ? R right Besides, that thing died after its hair changed color, didn't it? You're alive and kicking. Not the same at all. Exactly. But... I know. You're hungry, right? Can't think straight on an empty stomach. Let's head back to town and take a break, shall we? A hot bath and a hot meal is all you need, mate. You'll see. I'm with Karu on this one. Let's head back for now. What does it mean? In quest 28 to the rescue? Who are we rescuing? What rescuing are we doing? We're rescuing Isha? I've already gone through the ruins, so there's no uh, enemies to kill. There's no point not just fast traveling back. Spin, spin, spin. Well, they, 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 they were only like two blue haired people left. That's right. I'm sure you're not an experiment.
There's probably about 2,500 new quests now. Just you wait. Just you wait. Just you wait. Oh, there's one right there. Who the heck are you? Isha, have you got a minute? You are Isabella, right? I've only been here a few days and you've already memorized my name. I admire that kind of attention to detail. Unfortunately, I have to complain about something. What is with the old folks in this town? Ah, uh, yes. Well, I'm trying to warn them off making too much of a fuss. Well, ever since you started adventuring, they've been even more annoying than usual. Not all of them, of course. We should probably go look into that. Indeed. She's like, oh my god. Wait, what? You should really keep a closer eye on them. Why? I'm not going anywhere. Look at that. What? When did the clock tower get fixed? Now. It was not fixed when I was last here. He got it from pile of rubble to fix in two seconds. Look at all those quests to do. Trying to sleep. See ya, bossy. See ya, Jada. Good luck sleeping. This town is so dull. Fuck you. Something the matter? Even the residents are vile. But vile? I had held up hope that something would win me over. Some beautiful scenery or hearty rustic cooking, perhaps. But there is not here for a man of refined taste such as I. You enjoy looking down your nose at honest, hard-working people? Oh? So do you think this town has something that could impress the famous Enzo, then? Of course it does! Ain't that right, Isha? M me Well, you know this town more than me, after all. I don't know about that. What? Well, what about the delicacy we just began making? That m just might do the trick, mate. I'll wipe that smirk off your face. Get a delicacy from Rajiv. I eagerly wait await your attempt. I like they mean the black eggs. Alicia. Where could that boy have gotten to now? Are you okay? Oh, you're CJ, right? Nice to meet you. I'm Alicia. No, I'm not okay. I've never been okay lately. Or I'm never okay lately. What? What the fuck? When my boy's in here making trouble for me, he's elsewhere making trouble for others. Oh, has he run off? Want me to go look for him? I couldn't ask you to do that. We just met. But it would really help. My son has something of a reputation around here, see? If he puts up a fight, just tell him this. Whisper in the secret password. Ah, huh, okay. Got it. Pretty sure I know who she's talking about. Avon is his name, by the way. Good luck. I think you might need it. Leave it to me! You mean the same kid we've dealt with like the whole fucking game? Where could he have gotten to now? Maybe he went to pull some more tails. Although he did do that fish thing to apologize to the cat, so maybe, maybe he cooled now. Maybe he cooled now. Maybe. Let's check for quests over here. Some old person over here want to talk. What? No old people want to talk? What? There's nobody over here? It's like a first. Where are all the old people then? I'm supposed to talk to them to get the complaints and stuff. And this Alicia one's gonna be really tough. I'm gonna move one square over, one screen over, talk to Ava and go one screen back. Guarantee it. Hey, look, there he is. Oi, little boy, your mother's looking for you. Like I care. She'll be mad at me whether I go home or now or not. So what's the point? She knew you'd say that. 
Told me to let you know if you don't run back, it'll be carrots for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Blah. Okay, okay, I'll go straight home. Just tell her to keep those carrots away from me. Damn it. I like carrots. Carrots are tasty. It don't matter to me if you're around or not. I won't give them outlanders an inch. That's true, I suppose. I'm hearing reports that the outlanders are dissatisfied lately. We cannot afford an incident. Please consider your behavior. I'm making no promises. God damn it. Found him! He should be back soon. He really hates carrots, huh? Sorry to have troubled you, CJ. Thanks for your help. Have a stamp. Thank you, thank you. Where are all these people? Sex Street, Root Court, Outlaw, Lay, Sex Street. Uh, okay, they're all up there. Not at the farm. Oh, we're doing this first, huh? Bartender. The usual. Roger that. Have love on the way. How about you two? Mega Katsu Curry! What about you, Isha? Red Hot Tom Yum Kung or however the hell you pronounce that? I don't fucking know. Just tea, please. A cup of tea won't recharge your batteries, mate. You can have a few bites of my pavlova if you want. Sweet enough to set you right. You know she always orders spicy stuff, don't you? Pavlova, Mega Katsu Curry, and a pot of tea for now then. Isha, take your time and order as you like, pet. I'll have some red hot Tom Yum Kung ready with your name on it. So don't worry about anyone getting to it first. Thank you, Sarita. You're worrying too much, Isha. I mean, even if that sorcerer had done something funny to the folk who used to live here, that doesn't mean it's got anything to do with you. I hate to admit it, but CJ's right. Then why can I use magic without a lens? That's, well, I don't have all the answers. Wasn't it you who said magic can only be used by a special individual chosen by a lens? Well, technically it was my dad that said it, but yeah. So my magic is... what then? Should I just pretend I didn't see that monster and those people with the same hair color as me? Newbie adventurer? Uh, help! Someone help! You're hurt, pal! What happened? I'm f fine. It's my friend. Please, someone has to help. Elaborate. We were in the Barrows on our way to the Snow Peak when we were attacked. We took it down, but some took some hits in the process and I didn't have enough medicine on me. I could walk, so I decided I'd best go get help. Please, I'm b begging you. When you fail to prepare, you prepare to fail, mate. As you can see, we're waiting on some grubs to move along and... I'll go. This acting mayor? Really? Hold on now, just... Me too! Couldn't enjoy a hot meal knowing I let someone die. It's in the fine print, mate. Your safety is your own responsibility. Garu, you're coming too. Wait, I'm not. CJ, where do you think you're going? What am I to do with this curry? Sorry, Sarita. I'll be back soon. She's like a tornado, that one. Blowing in and out. I'll be going too, then. Of course you are. Not going to let them do all the work, are you? Go. Don't worry about the money. Let me finish my sentences, lady. No. What is with the women in this town? 
You're gonna help too? Thank you, friend. I really owe you one. All of you. You stay right here. If you can't fight, you'll only get in the way. Your mate is where the barrows meet the snow peak, yeah? Whereabouts? Right where the men here at the farm leads you. Bartender, our dinner's on him. I'll be waiting. Take a seat. Eat something while you're here. They'll take care of the rest. Th thanks. Pavlova and Mega Katsu Curry, as requested. Uh, sweet and spicy t together? Isn't that strange? Be grateful the other one didn't order the red hot Tom Yam Kung or whatever the fuck you I need, I need, we need, we need, we need, we need some, we need, we need, we need like a nickname for it. We don't need to save no injured adventurer. We've got some side quests to do. I'm pro, you're noob. Hmm. I disagree. Wait! I know you! You were one of the guys who left Malor behind! Oh, is he? Gah! CJ! You and other weaklings like you don't deserve to be called adventurers! <sighs> You're right. I am? <laughs> I already know I'm not cut out for this. I'm Lucas, by the way. I got a lot of shtick for running off like that. Gokto let me have it. Squash and Hogan, too. The less said about Yugo's reaction, the better. <laughs> Everyone said I should apologize to Malor. And you. I CJ, Garu, Isha. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Sounds like you've had a hard time. Apology accepted. Thank you. I'd like to apologize to Malor, but... Do you think she'd hear me out? I could go ask her for you. I'll let her know. I hope she'll let me say my piece. What about the other guy? There was two of them that ran off. Rajiv, we need one of your super cool black eggs! Coming right up! That's right, it's time for side quest montage. There's a lot of side quests in this game. Each side quest you complete, you get a red stamp, which is what those things at the top middle are. And there's multiple levels. Right now we're on the platinum level with 50 quests. The last level was gold with 50 quests. And the level before that was uh, something with 30 quests. Uh, we're at like... What are we at? 50, 80... We're at 120? No, wait, 110. 110, 113 quests so far. And then, there's probably another level after Platinum. It's just uh, endless quests. A lot of the quests are really simple too. It's like, go talk to this person. Go literally one screen over, talk to the other person, go back the other screen over and talk to the first person, and you're done. AJ, did I hear right that you've been up on the snow peak? Well, yes, but what's it to you? Got a job for you, assuming you don't mind heading back up there. That depends. What do you need me to do? I need some furs, the type that can only be gotten up on that mountain. I probably already have these. Furs? Too easy. Exactly what I wanted you to say. And it's, if it's not too much trouble, take this warded pack with you. Okay, but why? That's a secret, I'm afraid. A secret? Why? Tell me. My lips are sealed. Huh, fine. Wow, I've already got small pelts. Wow, quest's already complete. I'm back. Fur from the snow peak as requested. Hmm, yes, this is from the Snow Peak, all right. And what of my bag? Huh? You don't want to check the fur a little closer? I mean, sure, I have the bag. Oh, I see. Yes, yes, just as I thought. The experiment is a success. How about you fill me in on this little experiment of yours? No harm in it now, I suppose. I'll tell you. 
You used a men here to get to the snow peak, didn't you? Well, yes, but what's it to you? The men here bend space, time and space. I'm used to the things being space and time, not time and space. Time and space! Seems as if they're connected to somewhere deep within the barrows. The ancient text you brought me last time suggested, from what I could catch, that their power could have an effect on my snow packs. So I had you take that warded pack with you to see what kind of effect they were talking about. And it worked! I have learned much already. You'll be happy to hear this means I can make my snow packs even better now, too. Oh, that's good, I suppose. I'm self-taught in all this. Toying and tinkering is the only way I know how to learn these things. Anyway, here, have a stamp. Woohoo, one more stamp! 114 quests now! Woohoo, 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 woohoo! Out of at least 130. But probably more. No, wait. And no, can have like a thing with 160. Wow! Wow! I got three rows now! Stuff them full of healing items. Well, I guess I'm done with that. Another two could be for anything I pick up, I guess. Hey, Malar! That Lucas guy who ran off on you- ran- Oh, wait, wait. That Lucas guy who ran off on you in the barrows. Apparently, he'd like to apologize if you'd let him. Oh, that guy. Huh. If he really wants to say sorry, he can come and find me himself. I don't know if I'll forgive him, though. We'll see. Nice thinking, Malar. I'll let him know. See, this is move one screen screen over, talk to her. Now we're gonna go one screen back and talk to Lucas again. There's one infamous quest where I walk twenty paces over to the right, walk twenty paces over left, and the quest is done. That's that's the best one. Malar said she'd hear you out any time, so you should go find her. She did mention that she doesn't know if she'll accept your apology, though. Wow. Okay. Thanks. I guess I'll go get this over with. Let me stamp that card for you. Woo, 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 woo. Another one down. Mm, let's go check out second straight. You! CJ, you busy? Mind if I ask you a favor? Not at all. What can I do for you? I was wondering if you'd send a message to that woman for me. Tell her, I'm happy you're okay. Don't worry about the debt. Does this mystery woman have anything to do with that old friend you told me about last time? Yes. It's her. A long time ago, she was manipulated into trying her luck as a singer by some bad apples. Fell into a lot of debt. She borrowed from me, too, but she never seemed to have enough. Eventually, she vanished. The vase she sold was made to look cracked. I suspect it was her way of trying to pay me back. But I don't need it. I don't want it. Not after all this time. I understand. I'll see if I can find her. No pressure or anything. Yeah, right. Tell her not to worry, okay? Who are you? Laurel? You know where I can get some good food? Oh, sorry. I should introduce myself. Name's Laurel. She's beautiful. If it's good food you're after, you should head up on, on over to Sarita's Tavern. What's up? It's my sister, Earl. She's a fussy eater, to say the least. And a hungry girl at that. Sometimes I think she'll never be satisfied. Sarita will definitely have something she'll like. What is your sister like? I'll go get something for you. She's partial to anything with eggs in it, I suppose. 
I still don't know this town very well, so I appreciate the help. You got elves in this game, too? I mean, we just have animal people walking around and nobody bats an eye at it, so it's obviously ordinary in this world. I guess elves are ordinary, too. Excuse me, I have a message for you from Renee. I'm happy you're okay. Don't worry about the debt, he said. Unthinkable, after my cruelty. I think he was serious. When he realized who you were, he seemed really happy. Not only that, but I think your disappearance is the reason he opened that shop in the first place. Because of me? So if I was you, I'd go see him again. You're right. I will do that. Sarita, don't suppose you could whip up one of those folded omelets real quick? For you, CJ, I certainly can. One folded omelet coming up. Let's go deposit our things. OMG, because of you. Uh, me. Me. Uh. That lady said she would come by to see you. Seriously? Thank you so much, CJ. I'd better get her money ready to return it. I think she's in more interested in seeing you than the money. Me? Oh my. Is my hair okay? Maybe I should book a table at Sarita's and... Hey, don't tease me, alright? I feel silly enough as it is. Serendipity pendant level five. What does that one do again? I don't know what that one does. Increases critical hit rate. Ooh, thirty percent is pretty fucking good. Ooh. How do me and my pug be cool like you? Well, you see. First, you got your sunglasses, and then you just chill. That's right. It's chill. Is that how it works? Pull it. I'm back. Think your sister will like this? Thanks. You know what? I think she just might. That was tough. Those look so cool. That's goddamn right they do. Nothing, nobody we haven't found yet, huh? Ta-da! New Nevaeh's very own delicacy! Super cool black eggs! What on... Black? My word! <laughs> oh, just shut up and eat it! Its fragrance is formidable even after just one bite! Unique texture. Um, what are these new flavors? Oh my. This is magnificent. Addictive. Um. You ate the whole thing. So, how was it? Hmm. 
My, I stand by my assessment. My fingers have become dirty from eating it. Pretty sure to bring some utensils to eat it with tomorrow. Tomorrow? So that means... I cannot possibly make up my mind unless I eat it at least twice. Don't you bumpkins know anything about taste? So, uh, the th third time? Third time? What was hers again? Speak with the town elders? Oh, they're up there, apparently. Wasn't I up there before, though? He's so fancy. A re he's a refined, elegant gentleman. Hi, kitty cat! Who's a good kitty cat? You are! You're a good kitty cat. Outlander Lane isn't such a bad place. Lots of delicious food down there. Still don't like Outlanders, though. There will be new dishes next week, from what I've heard. Hmm. Nice try, Missy. But I still don't care for your lot. Hey, what? Just her? Where's the next one? All the way over there. Oh, my gosh. Can you kill things in this game? You can when you're not doing side quests. So why wouldn't you want to do side quests? That's like 80% of this game, right? Feel it, doing side quests fills my heart with joy! Oh. You're a lot what that's supposed to mean. The old people don't like the outsiders because they came to this town. I want, they don't want no outsiders. They were getting along just fine before these adventurers showed up. So the Outlanders are feeling uncomfortable. I see. Yes, indeed. I fear we cannot allow things to escalate any further. More than protecting the city, we should be taking care of each other as fellow humans. You have my word. I shall endeavor to maintain good relations. Fair. I should be happy there's outsiders. They brought a bunch of businesses and tourism and all kinds of stuff. Well, we found at least one objector willing to listen to reason. I'm sure being the acting mayor must be tough. We'll just have to wait and see what happens. Wow! No extra side quests there. It's back to just the main quest. Save the injured adventure in the rune barrows. You wish your pumpkin would grow? Okay, well, watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Woo! Was that impressive? Was that impressive? Is that impressive? A pumpkin grill. Pumpkin spice grill. Move. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna block screen. You won't be able to see nothing. <laughs> GG. I totally fit as a pumpkin in this farm area, though. How did I do that? I don't know. The fire cat, you don't love he, her, her. She knows I do. She's a big baby. I'm amazed. Please take this. Oh, stamp. Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Now where exactly? Oh, it's back over here. At the entrance? All right. Am 
Yeah, I've got like a 30% chance to crit now, so... Have we seen critical? All caps. Big bold plot. A lot more. The Seeker of Truth's card is 20 out of 20. <gasps> it is! Big baby, she's your Oni owner. Damn it. She's the, she's the master, I'm the servant. That's right, that's right. That guy said his mate was around here somewhere. Woman's voice. Oh no, crap! I can't let it find me here! That voice! It came from over there! Uh-oh. Another rune golem? Wounded adventure, huh? Huh? Y you guys! Please, help me! Hold tight, mate. Over here, you ugly mug! We'll take you on! Thank you. You guys saved my life. Mate, he must be a fellow Aussie. I mean, look at him. His name's Guru, by the way. He's a kangaroo. He's a kangaroo man. His name's Garu. He says mate. Of course he's an Aussie! My new tower wonder card's ready for me. My Tower Wonder card? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see how many stamps I have to do on that one. Sure, he must be an Aussie. That's right! You can thank your pal when you see him next. He told us he left you here and asked us to help. Is he okay? He's a little beat up, but he'll live. Had enough life in him to send us after you, after all. Thank goodness. Such bad luck. To, turn, to run straight into a rune golem. I didn't run into him. Something is very weird around here. I thought I saw someone from the town, but when I asked him for help, that rune golem came out of nowhere. Elaborate! This guy came from deeper down the barrows. He looked just like he'd come from the town, though. I called out to him for help. I think he heard me because he looked right this way. But he just stood there mumbling something. Then he did this creepy little dance and vanished. Next thing I know, I'm face to face with a rune golem. Basically what happened to us in the end of the quarry. Father. Certainly sounds like what we saw. What could he be doing down here? Huh? Something fell. Is this... A diary? Yes, it's father's diary. Damn, good thing he kept a book. His handwriting, it's definitely his. Ugh. I want to know what's in there just as much as you do, but we've got to get her back to town first. True, her friend will be sick with worry. Let's head back. You can read and walk at the same time. Your friend is safe and sound, sir. Oh, thank goodness. I won't forget this kindness. Here, take a stamp. This has me rethinking this whole adventurer thing. Maybe I'm just not cut out for it. What are you saying? Wounds will heal. We'll be back on our feet in no time. But you... You think a little setback like this is going to stop me? I told you I'm going to see those barrows with my own two eyes. Now that sounds like an adventurer. It's important to learn about your limits. And about what to train in advance. And about preparation, of course. But to me, it's iron will that makes an adventurer. The unbreakable determination to press on. Find the treasure and make it out of any situation alive no matter what. 
Wow. That's actually a decent speech. With spirit like that, you can definitely make it to the depths of the barrows. I believe in you. Thanks. I'll make it. No doubt in my mind. Cut. Fine. I'll go too. Can't let you take all the glory. Obviously. Even if you tried to worm your way out of it, I'd drag you down there myself. Stock up on meds next time, yeah? And take care of your weapons. Good advice. Thanks. Sorry to keep you waiting, Isha. Let's take a look at that diary, shall we? Yes, of course. Too many eyes around here. Let's go somewhere quiet. My place. No one will bother us there. You got a new kid and it bullies your pug. It's showing you the pug who's in charge around here. In quest 29, after the truth! We seek the truth, man. Look at all the quests that just popped up. Uh, I'll see main quest right there, right? Wait. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. We got enough quests? What, what, we got enough quests? I, I know you warned me, Dolby, but I underestimated what you when you said that. Still a cool game, though, but my, man, these devs really, really love quests. This is uh, clearly their favorite part of, like, the game. Some of these I can already do. Three of them I can already finish. Let's see. Second Street, Rain Quarter, Outskirts, Shadowline, Second Street, Outskirts, Plaza, Far, Far, Far. Three alone in the farm. 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 Doesn't look like there's any residential right now, though. Can't wait to find out how many stamps my Wonder Tower card. Oh, wait, Tower Wonder card has. Whoa, is that a top? Is that a fox person? North. Miss, miss. You okay, kid? My the name is N North. I lost my p p papa. Would you h help me? Sure. Tell me about your papa. You don't know him? He's the best hunter in the land. Hunter? Okay, I'll take a look around. My papa sure is amazing. If you say so. Oh, oh, is this a squirrel? Is that a squirrel or a dog or something? I can't tell. Charlie? Why is everyone so childish around here? Says the kid. You seem upset. Charlie's my name. I was hoping to make some friends here, but everyone here is so immature. Not that I want to hang out with old folks or anything. You know, just someone a little older than me would be nice. I wonder if there's anyone who fits that description around here. I know of one. I thought that too, but they're a little... Couldn't hurt to try. Please, tell me about this person. I'll tell you, but you might not like what you hear. Let me go check with them first. Someone more mature. Just a little more than me. We're gonna do Avon. they arguing about you play breakers anymore Nah, i got the plat for that a while back i don't typically stream a game after i get all the achievements or trophies it was like maybe what two two three months ago i think i got the plat in february actually yeah cool game though he's amazing how come he lost you 
And I got flat, you were there. You were? Oh. <gasps> you should have gotten your complimentary stamp then. Oh, wait, we don't have stamps. I just made that up. Uh, I'm not, never mind, never mind. I used to do moments when I completed the games, but uh, Twitch got rid of moments, so. <laughs> Twitch sucks. How could they do this? <laughs> still mad about it. I'm still mad about it. Twitch killed fucking moments for what? Stories? Fuck you, Twitch. How dare you? Bring back my moments! <laughs> you CJ? The same CJ who caught the legendary salmon? I'm Jill. I'm on a quest to catch the extra large salmon. Up for a challenge, are you? Extra large salmon? Wait, which is better? I can, I can tell you. Which is bigger? <laughs> In that case, challenge accepted. No one can catch this salmon but me. Sure, sure, sure. You must be the girl who's been breaking everyone's fishing records around here. CJ, right? I'm Ming Ming. Bet you, but, but even you can't possibly catch a large catfish. Large catfish? Sounds fun. I'll give it a shot. Ha! Huh. I'd like to see you try. You'll live to regret those words. You'll need more meat on your bones to pull a large catfish out of the water. If you say so, dude. If you say so. Both of those are barrows? Interesting. Let's see if there's anybody in the pasturage who needs help. Looks like a no. Nope. Now I've got almost 10 more stamps. Only 10 more stamps to go until Platinum Card is done. That's hard to believe. But it's true. But it's this kid right here. Oh. No, oh, where is he? Never mind. Young lady, you may call me Jackie. You have the look of an adventurer about you. Have you, perchance, heard tales of the Barrows being home to a rather special hammer in your adventures? I haven't yet, but I'm more than happy to take a look for you. Wait here. You have my thanks. I think I saw one of the quests in the outskirts. Dino? PJ, I'm bored. I need you to play with me. Play with you? I'm an adventurer, kid. Very busy. Don't you have any friends your own age? I guess it's not that easy to make friends, huh? I'll go find you some friends. Just wait here. I just want someone to play with. I don't need friends. I mean, ain't that what friends are? TJ, a moment? Sure, what is it, Hugo? You enjoy collecting these stamps, yes? I have a task for you if you're up to it. Go on! Frankly, it's been too quiet around here. My sword arm hasn't been this stiff in years. I should like to test my blade against giant hunks, hunks of ice. I have heard much of their durability. We shall see about that. I can probably get ice, ice hunks from the monsters on the summit, I suppose. Got it. Be right back. I already got one. One giant hunk of ice, just like you asked. You have my thanks. I'll probably need you to fetch another one soon. It's probably because it melts. Bum 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 bum. Guess she had some new tasks. 
Mm, my task will. Uh, I have a task. Uh, go on snacky break pretty soon. I'll talk to all these sons of bitches first. A lost bee child's daddy? Probably here on Outlander Lane, I'd wager. My thoughts exactly. We still have achievements. I hope I can see one tonight. I think you will. Hey, you, come here. Yes? I'm Tarai, but it doesn't matter who I am. What matters is who you are. You know Master Yugo, don't you? Master Yugo? I suppose I do, yeah. I'll only ask this once, then. There's nothing going on between you and Master Yugo, is there? Going on? Come on, mate. Look who you're talking to. Whatever. Look, I've been doing a little investigation on Master Yugo, and I found out he's partial to salted plums. Huh? I'd like to gift Master Yugo some salted plums, but I can't seem to find any around here. Would you try to track them down for me? Would you try to track them down for me, F12? I can try, but if you're, if you're say there are the F fucking 12 again, if you say. But if you say there aren't any around, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to look. Hogan told me before that he's stalked them from time to time. Unfortunately, now it doesn't seem to be one of those times. Okay, well, if I find any, I'll bring them straight to you. Great forest, huh? Little red, wrinkly things. Yes, I know what a fucking plum is. Thank you very much. A hunter? Well, there was a beast man in here earlier talking about going hunting in the woods. The forest, huh? You are Miss CJ, are you not? Miss CJ? Wow, um, yeah, that's me. I am Michelle. I believe you have already met my employer, Master Enzo. Oh, that gourmet guy who hangs around the inn? The very same. I have heard from my master that you are... reliable. Got upgraded from Vile, did I? My master had intended to investigate the mine, you see. If plenty of ore were to be found within, this town would no doubt be a prime investment opportunity. In that case, please leave everything to my associate, CJ, here. What? Isha? Damn. We'd never be able to get the plat for Dead by Daylight. I got the plat for Dead by Daylight in 2017. I'll have you know. Or maybe 2018. I think it's 2017. I've had that plat for like seven years. What are you talking about? 100%'s the trickier part because they keep adding new DLC trophies. And I only buy the DLC when the when it's uh, half off. So there's several I haven't gotten yet. Although that uh, alien uh, robot guy was 40% off recently, but 40%'s not 50%, so you know. You never, uh, wait, see you, dude? I mean, pro, I mean, dude. What? I'm pro! There's 200 achievements in Dead by Daylight? Yeah, I bet there's a lot. But I've got the platform on PS4. I'm not doing it again on Xbox if that's what you're paying. Not a chance. There's very few games I would ever. Do a repeat of again. Dead by Daylight ain't one of them. Think you might try and grow plums? You're gonna try to grow some plums, Dolby? High purity ore, huh? Alright, we got what you asked for. Incredible. Now if you'll stamp my card, I'll be on my way. Don't worry, we can, we can get you some plums to grow. Oh, is that the sister? Hey there, lady. Got a minute? She's too beautiful! Why am I nervous? Yeah, yes? You happen to have seen a girl who looks like me around here? She's my sister. Goes by the name Laurel. Oh, you must be Earl. I haven't seen Laurel around in a while, though. Looks like I'll have to find out for myself if she went off into the woods looking for elves. 
You can't go into the forest by yourself. Let me take care of it for you. I'm sure she's hiding in that forest somewhere. I've got like three quests now that involve going to the forest. Hey, Malar. What's up, CJ? There's this kid called Charlie looking for older friends. You wouldn't be interested in that, would you? Charlie, the fluffy kid? Interested? I'm in, CJ. Is that so? You okay, Malar? You look a little pensive. Oh, hi, scavenger girl. Yeah, I'm just thinking about what happened. Ah, the eruption? Yeah, that was really something. You don't think everyone hates me now, do you? I mean, no, you dumb dumb. Some self-awareness at last, eh? I'm sure they don't, but if you like, I could go ask around for you. Wait here, I'll report back in a bit. I'll just be here. Self-reflecting. I brought you will be here self reflect on I've almost done a full loop of the town again. CJ, help! I need your help. What's the matter? It's about the treasure chests them bandits took from me. I heard another one's been seen. Down the barrows, no less. One of them ventures said they saw it down there. If it's in the barrows, won't be long before bandits get their hands on it again. I'm afraid that's all I've got to go on. But would you mind? Leave it to me. I hate it when they stu want stuff from the barrows because I have no idea which area they want it from. Who knows whereabouts in those barrows it could be. Exactly. That's why I don't like it. There's like 12 areas in the barrels. You! You're one of those guys who abandoned Malor! G CJ! G Garu! Isha! That's me, alright. Name's Starling, by the way. Not that it matters what you call a coward like me. Huh? I've been getting earfuls from everyone. Gokto, Squash, Hogan, even Yugo. Makes sense that you've come to say your piece. I heard my pal Lucas was looking to apologize, too. I should do the same. So, I guess I'll start with you three. TJ, Isha, Garu. I'm sorry for being such a sorry adventurer. Hey, hey, don't make this awkward, okay? I think Malor deserves more than words, though. Any idea what she likes? Chocolate cake. How do you, of all people, know that? I asked her last time we met. Took note of the important stuff. Important stuff? A chocolate cake it is. Do you, uh, know where I might get one? I can get it for you, in exchange for a stamp, of course. Really need to show her I'm sincere about this. Do, 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 do. We've now done a loop of every area except the residential interior because I don't think there's a quest up there. Yet. Just you wait. Hey, Sarita! Or hi, Sarita! Could you cook up a chocolate cake for us? I certainly could. Let's do a loop over here and see if there's anybody who wants to say anything about my lore. Looks like a no. Well, anyone's uh, that's over in the plaza or wherever. I can't wait to see what music or here I guess technically what music pops up after platinum's completed here you go one chocolate cake she'll definitely hear you out when she sees this I owe you guys big as promised a stamp 
So many quests, so little time. Wait, what the fuck are you want? Malor, that magic girl? Malor? Hmm, she's a liability from what I've heard. I, for one, wouldn't want to go adventuring with a sorcerer as wild as her. That's for sure. I can't say I blame you. Malor, Malor. Young lads probably have a lot of time for her, I imagine. But I like my sorcerers a little less green behind the ears. The type that can look about after themselves in a pinch. Since she, she is pretty inexperienced, I suppose. That would certainly put people off. Damn. No way! That boy chased Yum Yum away! He did what? Malar? Of course I know her. She's great. You really think so? She's really pretty and she's strong enough to break that wall. I hope I can be like her one day. When you put it like that. Hmm. Someone chased off Yum Yum? I'm gonna fucking kill him, man. How dare they do that? How dare they do this? You again, wasn't it? No way. He's too cheeky. Even for you? Yeah. Is that for Dino? Dino's friend thing? Even Avid won't play with him? Poor kid is so doomed. North! That's my boy! Oh, great! Go get him! One of them, my freaking gold. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> all right, all right, snacky break. I can't do any more quests on an empty stomach. I need food. I need food. I'm gonna lose my mind. I lose my mind. ERB! All right, let's go do quests, I guess. I don't know. I guess I surrender. Wait. Right, forest. Arm. Barrows, rune barrows. What's the difference between rune barrows and barrows? Let's just go to the forest and do the forest stuff first. Too many quests, not paying attention. Uh, to TLDR that. Ah. I don't even know how many quests I have here. At least two. Can you give me a stamp sticker of y'all? Hmm. Empty. I said stamps plural. So you're already way ahead of all these other questing weirdos who only give me one stamp.
My joke, by the way. Is it ever a joke with you? I presume you are the most serious man alive. Obviously. Uh, was one of them fishing here? Let's see, full rare salted plums. What's barrows? Both the fish one are in the barrows. Find an elf. Elf and plums. I don't know which direction that's gonna be. I guess we'll go down first. Oh. Found the elf. Crenoel. I don't suppose you are. Crenoel is my name. I've been tasked by Miss Laurel to deliver a message. I should get to Miss Earl as soon as possible. In that case, hop to it. Don't let us slow you down. She's worried sick. What was here? I forget. Thumbs are probably going to be up on the surface, though. On this? Whoa. Those are herbs. Hot plums. Thousand, huh? You're welcome to review your Sea of Thieves notes that I got. I still think you take the game too seriously, though. The game's supposed to take five years. Go forth, find us a cheese. Why is she still here? Hmm, I think it's gonna be up top. Or the plums, but we'll see. Your, your Sea of Thieves no, review you were talking about. Hmm. These guys with the plums? Up, oh, guys. There you going, buddy. Okay, I guess I got the salted plums. I wasn't expecting Bandits to be carrying them, though. Any reason to fight those bots?
The one you just said? Hmm. Yeah, I like that one. That's definitely a Sea of Thieves note. There's no quest for the quarry, I don't think. Started everything, huh? There's some very sea of thieving looking boats there, yeah. Totally found the newest cheese, right? Totally. Definitely. Your papa will be here shortly. Thank you, miss. said she'd be friends with you. She's a little older than you. Really? I'll go say hello. Thanks, old lady. Old lady! Damn, she's 16. She's old lady. He'd call me... He'd call me grandma. Sure, I love making new friends. Really? That's great. out here at that. What's the rare exploits? They're, they're tied in somewhere. Every fifth veil, the loot doubles or some shit like that. The veil is appeared above Old Faithful and the brig go into it. Well, very pure run. Reno said he'd come play with you. You and him are around the same age. Seriously? I mean, I'll play with him if he wants. All right, all right. Go on over and play nice. But give me my stamp before you go. <laughs> Shocking challenge when the super cards arrive. Defeat two possessed three without being hit. Two is in two of them in a row? I'm touching new reflex potion. Oh, he's level 30 now. He's just upgraded. There's one. Has completed stamp earned. Oh, I thought it was two in a row because you uh, defeat two possessed tree. Oh, well, now it's gonna be two. No spider or something? Did it, two in a row. Yes, uh, yeah, you said your message said defeat two possess three. Two is not spelled like number two, but I thought it was just a just a misspell. GG. Thank you for the stamp.
Hmm. I don't think I have much more I can do right this second. Talk to Melora, I think. Oh, elf lady in the rune courtor. Other than that, I gotta go to the barracks to get all the other shit. Nope, nothing here. Yes, it's all in Rune Kotor. Seems like you're uh, pretty popular with kids. Girls in particular. Kids, huh? Girls. I see. Yeah, well, at least one. A role model for little girls everywhere. Of course. That's exactly what I am. I'll get stronger and tougher and faster and... Whoa, slow down. That went well, I think. Lapis lives will leave, will leave. I don't care about that. I wanted a stamp, bitch. You didn't even give me a stamp for that. He found someone named Crenoel in the forest. That's Simpleton? She sent him of all people? Well, if your sister is okay, that's all that matters, right? If she's dumb enough to run off in the woods, then then more fool then more fool me for wait, then more fool me for worrying about her. Wait, what? Whatever you say, stamp please. I'm not sure that was an English sentence, but okay. Hola, mi amigo. Hello, friend. To you, too. I found the salted plums you wanted. Thank you. Wow. These smell sour, huh? They sure do. Weird that he actually likes this stuff, isn't it? Yeah. What's all that? F what's all the fuss about? What is the matter with you two? Eh? A smell this bold needs to be breathed in deep. <coughs> Here, take your stamp. Firebomb 5, wow. How about you give me fucking money instead of items I don't want? Fuck off with this shit. Giant hunk of ice would be a snow peak, obviously. Barrel room, barrel, 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 barrel. I'm good the barrels, I guess. You must be doing your French homework. Bon Jour is all I got. I didn't even pronounce it right. I think I'm gonna help you pass your French homework class, okay? Your French, French whatever. Hmm. These are rune barrows. So Hogan's treasure will be here somewhere. Hammer will be here. And the fishing spot will be the fish. I go check back here first. Wow.
Oh, hi. What are you guys doing here? Oh, 45. What? What the fuck? That was a lot. What the fucking hell? A lot of damage. Where'd those guys come from? Ah, they were guarding the treasure. Hogan's treasure received. Okay. Well, I found that. I gotta go right for the hammer. That guy did like almost a thousand damage to me. That's crazy. Two of them survive? I wonder if the monsters that... There were, were items I didn't pick up. I wonder if you, if, you, if you don't pick up an item, if that respawns the monster so you can get the item again. Hmm. Very curious. to the next section of the barrows. There shouldn't be any quests in the Rune Barrow Depths, right? Because nobody knows that place exists. We're the first one there. No, they're, they're gonna totally put quests there. I'm dreaming. You're gonna be like, oh, you discovered this place. You're a big fan of magic. I bet you are. Magic is pretty cool. I prefer slicing things up myself, though. To load golem on the quarry with Isha without being hit. Oh my gosh. Call order. Actually, I don't think I've ever tried him with Isha. Hmm. I'll check down first. I doubt we'll find what we're looking for down there, but we'll see. Ham more down here. Hmm. 
<laughs> this is a fishing spot. Oh, an achievement. Fishing Master achievement unlocked. Caught a max grade fish. Wow! That sounds really cool. Achievement one out of what? Oh, it's time for the next step. Woohoo! Been a bit since our last save, isn't it? Been two hours since our last save. Oh, big deal if my power went out. Let's redo the last two hours. Love achievements, collect 21 more. Hmm. I don't know if there are 24 more left in this game. Or 21 left in this game. I'll do my best though. If not in this game, then the next one. be this one and there better be 21 left then. Check for the hammer up up here. Yes, I know this goes to that dead end I was at earlier. I actually remember this time. Well, I'd have to check for the hammer. Nothing this time. Ah! People chill on. I haven't seen people chill on there before. Hammer's pretty deep in. Wait, 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 wait. Why did I just get two more? What happened? Stuck up. There's like a terrain thing here. A hammer! 
Hammer! Should be the room with all the money, but I need the run for my fucking life first. Duck up there. Bah. I'm roll paw. If Thieves nuts for success. Hooray! Very good, very good. I actually have to buy heals if I keep running into strong things like those level 45 bandits. I do a thousand damage. That'd be terrible if I actually had to like buy heals. Time to finish this platinum card. I caught it! I caught the large catfish! You did? Wow, that's amazing. Wait, no! That means I lose. I'll catch a bigger one. You'll see. Those extra large salmon you were talking about. No way. You caught it? Grr, I'll not be bested by a whelp. Achievement incoming. Maybe. of the town completed the platinum stamp card wow rumors about the town are spreading far and wide people are coming from all corners of the world looking to set up shop right here you know chain link or chain up to five link attacks black wait so above platinum is black when are my psn black trophies coming
Stupid gray cat just jumped for the window sill and missed. That's fucking hilarious. Tell that she's the most graceful cat you've ever seen. Oh yeah, hammer guy should be right here, shouldn't it? Yep. I think I found what you were looking for. Good lord, this is it. Perfectly weighted. One sure strike with this. And I'll follow up with my sword. Dual attack. Bertrand will never see it coming. Bertrand? Allow me to stamp that card for you, young lady. Normally manages her jumps. Well, she's not used to the new environment. She miscalculated. Oops, walked backward. She jumped it a few times now. Well, uh, um, well, uh, she, um, uh, she uh, didn't cat math it right. She needs to work on the cat math. Oh wait, Hogan was the other one. More wares to adorn my walls. Here, take a stamp. You earned it. Growth pendant level five? What the heck be that? Uh. Well... <clears throat> Uh, I already scrolled past it. I wonder if that applies to everybody or just me. I'm surprised if it's just me. I need to get two more hardwood lumber for that. Oh my gosh. Yikes, the, fa the, the Thunderbird egg requirement's like, what? I thought I can get that from the farm, can't I? I can make a good amount of these, actually. Oh, I can't make level 5 yet. Choice fish? I haven't figured... I probably need the uh, fishing rod upgraded for that. Oh, I'm rock walking the wrong way. I was walking, got to walk through the plaza, and I'm going the wrong way. Rip. Rest in peace. Wait, wait, wait. So we gotta figure out what element load golem's weak to. And then go crazy.
Try fire. She's not very good at dodging, though. Wait, her dodge is teleport. Level 30 load golem, too. Ah, I already forgot that I have to use B for her. Blocked! Blocked! I think you need Garu for this guy. Or wait, can I destroy it? Oh, I'm damaging the shield. Ah! I took damage. Nah. Mm, let's, let's see. Let's see what Elba. Hot fire. I doubt Earth is gonna do shit. Hold on a second. Oh, I don't think I hit him. Oh yeah, it clearly does less damage than the fire one did. So if he's earth, that means I do water, doesn't it? Oh, wouldn't that be her default? Well, I could do an extra boost, actually. Uh, you got a tall order here. You got a tall order for this tap, man. Seems like water's the best one. Wait, how do I, like... Not get hit by the legs. Ugh. But the teleport is so garbage. Why not supposed to get hit by legs? Like the it's like it's just garbage. Uh, I think you got a tall order on this one. Cause I only teleport like this tiny little bit. Take three rounds. I supposed to the teleport so small. Do I get at least half a stamp for dealing with it? Well, the teleport range is so small though. I can't I can't teleport past the legs, so I get hit by just being there. It's so sad. Until you play Skull, you have to complete no hits on bosses. Well, they probably let you teleport to the other side instead of into their legs, okay? Half a stamp, what do I look like to you? Um, 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 um. A very captainly young man. Oh, that's where the giant stone is.
can't butter you up? Okay, but what if I... What if I try, um... Mmm... <clears throat> some cheese instead of butter. Nice melted cheese. Thing do will change your mind. Are you sure about that? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing. You sure? Half a stamp of word. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go read this diary. Let's see what's in here then. Well, I haven't seen this angle before. Right. I'm surprised she was able to wait so long. May 3rd. I received a clandestine letter from the Gal Galdian Empire regarding the rune barrows, signed by a man by the name of Hurstwine. He claimed to be in the service of a Galdian lord, but neglected to name any names. He offered a hefty sum in exchange for information on the barrows and exclusive rights to excavate therein. The barrows belong to the League of Nations. The choice to sell them off to some imperial nobleman is not mine alone to make. I must report this to Mulka at once. Exclusive mining rights? Why is the Empire being so sneaky about it? I do not know. I did not know any of this. Let's read on. May 18th. I cannot understand what Mulka is thinking. He will grant New Nevea neither funds to rebuild nor soldiers to protect its people from monsters. Surely even he can see this is a death sentence. And he had the gall to entrust me with matters pertaining to the Barrows. Some Margrave he has turned out to be. How can I alone save a town that has been abandoned by its Margrave? I fear I may no longer be in a position to resist Hurstwine's mysterious offer. I'd heard as much from the townsfolk, but what a useless Margrave he turned out to be. He just left everyone to die. Margrave Mulko's behavior was certainly odd upon reflection. How could a greedy little man like him turn his nose up at the money-making potential of the Barrows? Perhaps he and this Hurstwine character were conspiring together. You think the League of Nations would throw its oar in with the Empire? What's in it for them? Right. Selling the rights means the Empire gets to keep everything. The League wouldn't like that. If he was as greedy as you say, why wouldn't he keep it all for himself? Right. Exactly. What if, instead, he had been promised something more valuable than that which could be found in the Barrows? For example... For example... His own life and the survival of House Chantra. Nisha, what are you saying? If I were this Hurstwine fellow's lord, I would offer Mulka a chance to keep his lands free of Imperial influence, should the Empire become aggressive. In exchange, Mulka would be expected to turn a blind eye to anything regarding the Barrows. That alone would be enough to turn a spineless, self-serving man like Mulka. And the Empire could come and go as they pleased, with no one to oppose them. The League isn't just a tool for the Empire to use and abuse, though. What right would they have? Maybe that's why the, 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 the bandits are so well armed. They're actually Empire dudes. You think the Empire would start a war over one measly little ruin? No, perhaps not over one ruin. Regardless, starting a war would mean giving up their anonymity. Why expose yourself if you didn't have to? We know not who this lord is, but they are close enough to the emperor to wield his power. They must be of considerable influence. Highly ranked, no doubt. Someone callous enough to manipulate Mulka so readily may not care if their actions result in war. Or worse still, someone intent on sowing the seeds of disorder, 
Someone for whom war is the goal. Alright, alright. Let's keep in mind that this is your own little fantasy we're talking about here. Of course. But it would explain Mulko's behavior. And if I'm right, the person behind it must be more villainous than I can even imagine. A storm may yet be approaching. A big one. You sure know a lot about politics for a kid. Right? I told you before. My magic made it difficult to make friends. So my father bought me a great many books. The friends I knew in my books were the only friends I had. Remember, I live in a remote frontier town. Passing merchants and annual trips to the city were my only chance to add to my collection. Children's books were hard to come by. History, math, I was given a lot of awfully difficult books. Even still, I enjoyed when my father would read to me, and enjoyed learning to read myself even more. Every time I learned a new word, he'd pat my head, say something like, You're so smart, Isha. Good job. <laughs> like, oh. Garu, you're not crying, are you? Of course not. Just got something in my eye. You're the one crying, mate. Nuh-uh. My eyes are just a little... sweaty or something. <laughs> you know, if Isha is right... Why does this lord fellow want the treasure in the barrow so badly anyway? That I do not know. But according to my father, they also wanted information. It is possible they didn't know what that was down there, but they must have been looking for... something. Something? Something. Anything. I don't know. Let's keep reading. May 23rd. Today's General Assembly could not have gone worse. My proposal to send an expedition to the, into the barrows was opposed fiercely by the town elders. Something about a sorcerer of legend. Shiva, in particular, was very vocal in his disdain for the for my idea. Not surprising given what he knows about the barrel's blessing. Even so, there's no going back now. The pact with Hurstwine has already been made. I have heard the Empire's research into magic has been progressing well. If they would just lend us their support, I'm sure we could find a way around that damn blessing. The barrel's blessing? What could that be? Treasure. I suppose my father is my treasure. Growing up with this magic and this hair, everyone around me seemed unnerved. But my father always stood by me, even when no one else would. He told me this power was a gift from the land, encouraged me to be proud of who I was, of what I was. I was right. Just like the citizens of Old Nevea and those monsters. I'm one of that sorcerer's experiments. Oh no. Uh, wait, we, we don't all know that yet. She's right. There's more to read. More? The next entry is about the expedition into the barrows. I like the little jump you put in that. Uh. Uh, no comment. No comment. May 28th. While searching the barrows, we came upon a four-legged monster. Iron legs, no less. Except for me and Kukrit, who I believe may have escaped. The rest of the expe expedition team are... dead. Forgive me, everyone. I am wounded, perhaps beyond hope. Isha, I am so sorry for leaving you alone in this cruel world. You are, and will forever be, my one and only treasure. I wanted to solve the mystery of these barrows and free you from their blessing once and for all. My dear, dear daughter, I pray that your life be long and rich with happiness. <laughs> no! Isha, are you alright? Um, stupid question of the century. If this diary is to be believed, my father is already... In that case, who have we been chasing all this time? Okay, okay, take it easy. We don't know yet. Save your platitudes. Look, all this bl blood. Father, are you in 
the Barrows? Because of me? Nisha, life isn't always as simple as a treasure hunt, right? There'll be hard times and harder times again. There'll be times when you just want the earth to open up and swallow you whole. So never feel bad about falling to your knees if that's where the world is pushing you. Cry till you can't cry no more. But never, and I mean never, let life break your spirit. When you're done crying, you stand up and press on. No matter what. Just like she said before. Well, that sounds like an adventurer. It's important to learn about your limits and about what to train in advance and about preparation, of course. But to me, it's Iron Wheel that makes an adventurer. The unbreakable determination to press on, find the treasure, and make it out of any situation alive no matter what. Oh. No matter what they throw at you, if you can stand up on the other side of it, then you've not lost yet. The treasure that'll make it all worthwhile is in front of you, not behind you. So you gotta get back up. Isha, if we're ever gonna know the truth, we'll have to find whatever that was in the barrows. But, but we already searched the barrows. Father wasn't there. Take a look at this. What is that? The last page of the diary. The mayor drew this, didn't he? Father was an earnest researcher. This looks like he copied an old map of Nevea. And if this map is right, there's a men here in the plaza that'll take us somewhere we haven't been yet. In the clock tower? Men here? In the plaza? What do you... Ah! Yep, Shiva's clock tower. Old Shiva and his old pals built that clock tower around a men here. The people of Old Nevea must have done it after they sealed the sorcerer away. So that no one would ever go back to that part of the barrows. The mayor we saw is there. I just know it. My scavenger sense is telling me so. Sense, huh? Her scavenger sense is nothing to sniff at. Mercs have it too, you know. Instincts. Honed through years of experience. Okay, okay. I'll believe in your scavenger sense, CJ. We should find Shiva. Ask him about the clock tower. And about this Barrow's blessing. What is this plot? That's the most plot I've heard in like... Three streams. Watch okay, now that we did that, 12 more quests. The quests only seem to pop up when you go to a new uh, main quest, so, you know. Probably not, but still. Damn it, I didn't think so. You speak the truth! Chiba, we'd like a word. Quite urgent. <sighs> Can it wait? It cannot. We found the mayor's diary in the barrows. I think you should give it a quick look. Aksa, how could you be so stupid as to let the Empire make such fools of us? Shiva, please tell me everything you know about the barrow's blessing. Forget about that, you hear? There's nothing anyone can do about it now anyway. Shiva, please, please tell me. You'll wish I hadn't. In this town, every few decades, a child is born with a raw lens inside their body. These children all have azure hair, and they're all born with a natural ability for magic. So that's why Isha can use magic. Aye, you've got a raw lens, all right. Inside you. I... knew it. These azure-haired children are often skilled mages, but they don't get to enjoy it for long. And everyone's like, what? Of course, Spark explains why. What do you mean? What do you mean? 
The lens fills them with power and corrupts their bodies. Wait, I mean, and corrupts their bodies. They don't live to see adulthood. No! no. Why? Why? Why Isha? Why only Isha? Uh-oh. I'd wager it's because she's gifted. Knowledgeable. But I don't know. Damn it. As far back as I can remember, the townsfolk have called this the Barrow's Blessing. Of course, the youngsters don't know of it. Only Doxa and the other elders know anything about it. Shut up! You're wrong! You must be wrong! That's not a blessing! It's a curse! You want me to take these lonely, suffering children, look them in the eye and tell them they're cursed? Oh, sure, that would help. I didn't... No, I... The ancestors couldn't end it. Nor could I. Nor could Doxa. <laughs> and it, have you tried everything? You've tried absolutely everything to break this curse, have ya? If Doxa had any other options, he'd never have made a deal with the Galdians, would he? I see. So that's why my father ignored your protests and proceeded with the expedition. And you tried to keep me from the Barrows because you knew I had, well, not long left to live. I just wanted you to live your life in peace. That's all. Can you ever forgive me, Isha? Misha, look at me. Don't listen to another word of this. Thank you, Shiva. It would appear I have misjudged you. Look at me. You have every right to live. Anything you're born with belongs to you. Don't let some old curse make choices about who you are. Yeah, Garu's doing lots of um, big speeches today, isn't he? What gives this sorcerer and his magic the right? Just wait till I get my hands on him. The sorcerer. Magic. Wait. The sigil. Look, the sigil the mayor drew in this diary is the same as the sigil I saw in that lab down in the barrows. The monster in the hologram got trapped in the sigil. Then the sorcerer pulled the raw lens from its body. And what? You don't think it's odd? The sorcerer was supposed to be sealed away hundreds of years ago. But still, every few decades, right here in this town, a child is born with the blessing. Even though the sorcerer has been locked away for much longer than that. You mean... Doxa said something similar a long time ago. He didn't think the numbers worked. Exactly! Isha! Shiva! There's no sorcerer down there! Just a spell that's casting itself over and over. In the vision, the old Nevean who fought the sorcerer wasn't alone. The sorcerer performed the transmutation spell on all of them and grew raw lenses in each of their bodies. He said as much, didn't he? The grade of the lens is determined by the amount of magical power within the subject. Exactly! Something with a lot of magical power could grow a hide-grade lens if the transmutation spell was given enough time. But monsters like that don't come along every day. So instead of one big guinea pig, he tried it with many, many small ones. Exactly, Guru! Exactly! He sacrificed the old Navayans to try and mass-produce raw lenses. What a villain. Old Nevaeans must have been better with magic than the townsfolk around here today. That's why he was able to get several lenses at once from them. And of those people, some realized what he had done and sought revenge. His own creations turned against him. But the spell was set up so that, so that it would work even when the sorcerer himself wasn't there. Ke kept going by the sigil and this drawing and that humongous lens we saw. That's why I was born this way. It makes sense, doesn't it? That's the reason for Isha's lens, the sigil under the town. So stands to reason, if we head to the ruins under the plaza and smash up that sigil, Isha's blessing might just break too. Not might, it will. It definitely will. Isha and I didn't get off on the right foot, but she's my friend. No, my treasured friend. 
We have to try to save her. We have to try to try save her. F12, you're ruining my immersion. CJ, my immersion. We have to try save... F12, how could you? CJ. Nothing more to say, is there? Let's get down to them barrows and bust it up. Garu. Gramps, this clock tower used to be a men here, didn't it? It did? Wait, I do remember the elders mentioning something about that when I was little. The clock tower was built from a massive stone that had fallen in the plaza. I knew it! Oh, wasn't there an indent that a rune lens could fit into somewhere? That's the only way to power a men here. You're right. I saw it myself. The stone inside the tower has a ridge just to the right size for a lens to slip into. Where? Where? It's a hollow at the bottom, where the driving weight descends to ring the bell. There's no way to get you in there, though. Eh? Why not? And the gear that connects the driving weight to the transmitting mechanism is broken. No matter how many times I wind the drum, neither the weight nor the hands will move an inch. If we can't get that weight to move, we can't reach the hollow. I'm lost. I mean, just go get the materials. That's what I've been doing all fucking game. We need to rebuild the gear to get the clock tower to work. Until it works, we can't reach the men here. Is that right? Yes. Why didn't you just say that, then? All right, so let's go get a new gear made. Easier said than done. It's a big one, and it has to work with the other gears and pinions, too. It's got to be exactly the same as the original. There's no one around here who could make it. Where can, where can we find someone who can, then? In the capital. That's quite a trick. Or Galdia. The Empire? The Galdian Empire has a thriving mechanical industry. Surely one of their machinists can make it. Forget it. That's even further away. Capital it is. Why can't the smithy take care of it? Tatara's good, you know. I wouldn't know about that. Well, let's go ask him. Yeah, of course Shiva wouldn't know about that. He's been avoiding the Outlanders this whole time. He's been like, fuck you, Outlanders. I want nothing to do with you. Wow, so much plot in the last 20 minutes. Plot, 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 plot. Plot, 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 plot. Katara, we've got an order for you. What's the matter? You didn't chip something again, did you? Thankfully, no. I do have something I really need your help with, though. Probably quicker if we just show you. Do you mind coming with us to the clock tower for a bit? Mysterious. Well, I can't say no to you guys, can I? Head back to the plaza and I'll follow you over in a few. You have my thanks, Tatara. Head to the clock tower. Let's go. Tatara! Even Shiva's here? What's this about? We've got something to show you, but it's in the clock tower, so come along. We're loading! We're loading! Watch your step now. So this is what the inside looks like. I can't see. Oi, get a move on, will ya? This machine room's the beating heart of the clock tower. Here you'll find the gears to keep everything moving. Katara, we need you to build us a gear that will fit into this mechanism. Huh? You want me to make you a gear? No, oh, please, Tatara. We really need it. Hmm. But this type of work doesn't typically fall under the category of blacksmithing. It doesn't? 
Making weapons and equipment is based on forging, basically bashing metal with a hammer. This kind of intricate, finely detailed metal is made through casting, pouring molten metal into a mold. I'm afraid I've never done any casting before. Oh. Ah, come on. If you've seen one metal slab, you've seen them all, no? Don't tell me about my trade, bucko. The tools needed couldn't be more different. Which is it? Let me have a look. Huh. Interesting. I'm afraid I have absolutely no idea how this works. Looks like a headache to me. Do you still have the broken gear from before? Just over there. Hmm. Chipped, but mostly intact. Might be able to make a mold after all. Gonna need a big container to melt it down, though. But I'll need... Hmm... Yeah. Um, Tatara? We'll make a mold of the broken gear, then melt it down and cast it anew. Might work, might not. Oh! But we need something else. And I'm guessing it's not easy to get. Star Tears. Star Tears? Astralacrim. You're right, Guru. Not easy to get. Of course it's not. What is it, anyway? Star tears are what we call shooting stars. Tatar needs the type of steel that's taken from them. It's incredibly rare. What'd you need it for, anyway? Can't you just use the broken one? What if I could? But, like I said, it's chipped. You could try, try looking for the chip if you want. Can't we just make the gears out of regular iron? It's just that we don't really have a lot of time. I wish there was more I could do, but all these gears are made of astralacrib. If we just shoved in a gear made from something else, it'd break right away. Let's all just go look for the gear fragment. The bit that broke off. I already tore the place asunder looking for it. Assuming it didn't shatter, someone in town must have it. <sighs> Who'd have thought, thought making a simple gear would be such a pain? There's no steel stronger than astralacrim. Best there is for parts. Weapons and armor, too. But it chipped when it fell over in the earthquake. Must have been brittle. Poorly cast, probably. You might be right about that. All the other parts are still in one piece. Though it's got a reputation, I see. Understood, Tatara. We'll get you what you need. Wait for us at your shop. Sure. I'll have my son and his minor pals haul these parts over. You lot take care now. Hello, streaming adventurer. Do you happen to have the time? Time for what? What's up? Do you know anything about anyone who might have taken anything from around the clock tower? I'm looking for someone who might have a gear fragment. I reckon Awamuri might know something about that. Awamuri? Who's that? The drunkard who drinks in the plaza even though a perfectly good tavern got built. Oh, that guy! That guy from the beginning of the game? It's his fault. I don't know why, but I have a feeling Awamuri might be able to help. I'll go ask. Thanks. What time? Do you know what time it is? <gasps> it's uh, a paltry 1.47 in the morning. You're trying to get me to go to sleep? Someone's trying to get me to go to sleep. Have you seen Awa Murray about anywhere? I've already checked the plaza. Awa Murray, have you tried his house? 
I'm sure his wife Petra, or no, P Preta, would know where to find him. Unless she's already killed him. So he's married? Where's his house then? Well, into the residential district. Thanks a lot! That's that lady I got that knife for that one time. And she was like, oh yeah. We're gonna totally use this on him. Oh, that doesn't seem right to you? Hmm, it's, it's, it's pro time! That's what time it is. That clock up there says it's, uh, like a little past 1 p.m. or something. Well, do your final card to be tough? It's too tough. Tougher than Vanquish. Yeah, that's definitely the lady I made that uh, knife for. Alright, you had someone to make the knife for. You're Prada, right? Is Alwa Murray home? Of course he's not. Day in, day out, that old lout just drinks himself silly and never comes home. I'm finished with him. If I ever see him again, I'll string him up by the eaves by his underwear. Woo! Let's take a breath, Prada. No good drunkard. Death's too good for him. I kind of need him alive, though, at least for now. I have something I really need to ask him. So you, you might have, you have any idea where he might be? I should like to know myself. I'm guessing you've already checked the tavern. Yep, I did. And nope, he's not there. Any other ideas? Maybe he's finally sobered up then. And hiding is my guess. He knows what's in store for him when he comes back. He doesn't have the guts to step outside the town either, so he must be around somewhere. Like I said, he's probably hiding. This wasn't as helpful as I'd hoped. Okay, thanks. I'll go look for good hiding places. <sighs> I'm not angry at you. If you find him, just tell him to come home, okay? And if he actually comes home? I'll string him up but the eaves by his underwear. Got it. I'll let him know. 2.48 sounded like American time. It's 1.48. 1.50 now. I'm two. One. Are you saying yeah, you would prefer hiding where would I hide Task completed stamp earned oh he'd never leave town huh so he, would he be on the outskirts probably not Five out of ten. Thank you, six foot sounds about right. Yeah. You're saying I should play for two more hours. I guess that's some good foreshadowing, though. That guy's been laying around in the background for a long time. You saw him in front of the clock tower when the game started, and you saw him at the tavern a lot, too. Now we need you, lazy 
Daisy. Your laser dairy are over here. Is this a good hiding spot? Oh. Oh, Murray! I finally found you! Me? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Don't tell her I'm here! If you don't want me to tell Prada where you are, answer some questions. Sound fair? Uh, anything. Go ahead. Ask me anything. When the clock tower fell after the earthquake, did you see anyone take an iron-looking thing around this big from the plaza? I... Th no, I don't know about that. Not me. So you didn't see anyone pick anything up? You know, the last time I woke up in the plaza in the dead of night, I might have seen someone with something shiny. Shiny? What did they look like? I, I was half asleep. Besides, the only light was the moon. I c couldn't see them clearly. You've got to remember something. If you don't, I might just have to pay Prada a visit. Skinny. He was skinny. And he had a f feather on his head. Squash. A feather? Like on a hat? What else? It might have been a hat. His head was a funny shape, though. I don't remember him having a neck. Skinny with no neck? Was he wearing a scarf by any chance? Yes, yes. His neck looked fuzzy all right. And I think he had something in his mouth. A pipe, perhaps? No, it was sharper than that. And pointed downward, I think. Ha! Huh. When he took the shiny thing, his eyes got all shiny, too. I think I know who it might be. Thanks, Awamari. Then don't tell Prada where I am, okay? I've got nowhere else to go. She asked me to tell you to go home, but apart from that, I'm staying out of it. She asked you to what? She said she won't be mad, so you should go home. But if I go home, she'll... String you up by the string you up the eaves by your underwear, yeah. I'm not going home to that. Bye. Can't say I blame him. Ah, oh, your times are getting silly again. Oh no! Oh no! What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How are you doing to that? Squash! Did you take the shiny thing from the plaza a while ago? You've done your research, I see. A fragment of Astral Crim splintered off a gear, so I added it to my little collection. I knew it! That's a gear fragment from the clock tower. We can't fix it without that piece. Can we have it? Just as it is? Hmm. Is that so? Very well. Only fair to return it. Thank you. I owe you big. I might not part with it for anyone else, CJ. Apologies for inconveniencing you. I've got what you need. Nice work. I'll start the casting right away. I'll just have to start with the crucible, so come back in four or five days. Got it. Thanks, Atara. Four or five days later. <laughs> Hi, Tatara. Is the gear ready? Sure is. Not bad for my first time casting, if I do say so myself. You're my hero, Tatara. I can't thank you enough. Oh, stop. <laughs> Besides, it was pretty fun to try casting. I think I can expand my services thanks to you guys. If you need anything else cast, just let me know. Will do. We've got all we need for now, but if anything comes up, we'll swing by.
I don't know, it's time to go down there. I should just go to sleep, we should do it tomorrow. The pro dubs, yes! Rawr, rawr. Not gonna get me any more quests. What am I supposed to do? Not bulbs! Shiva, the gear is ready! You little star! With this, we can finally finish renewing new Nevaeh's pride and joy. I was wrong to treat you so poorly, CJ. You're a good person. Here, take a step. Damn. Even he's been turned around. The men here. Now we can finally head to the barrows beneath the town. Took long enough, didn't it? Come on, let's get this show on the road. Isha? My father made a deal with the Empire and put the townsfolk in danger by dragging them into the barrows. All for my sake. I've put the people of this town through so much. Can I ever make it up to them? Isha, listen. Doxa did everything he did to save his little girl. Now that little girl will have to pick up where he left off. Besides, you already have. Who else could have kept this town running like clockwork since Doxa disappeared? I shudder to think what'll become of this place without you. So if it's the town you're worried about, then go smash that sigil to bits and free yourself from this blasted blessing. Shiva, thank you. It's a stamp! I already told them they were players for complete, though. Hmm. I'm debating. I'm debating. Debating. I think I should just go to sleep. It's 2 a.m. And tomorrow we will. Go ba bash up that sigil and fight off all the bandits. And, um, the Empire or whoever else is the bad guy here. I forget. And after that, then I presume we'll be in post-game or... or to, well, it, I don't know if it's a uh, post-game or if it'll put you before the final boss or if it'll be New Game Plus or whatever. You better not New Game Plus me and make me do all those quests again. I'm gonna be mad. Man, like, don't you dare even think about it. Ghost of Tsushima toasted. Nah, we still got a good ways to go on that. Ghost of Tsushima is on Thursday. Thursdays. We're still on our first playthrough for that. Although I will, uh, I pretty much done all the side quests in the second section, and next time I will be attacking the castle. In the second section, and unlocking the third area. Probably. Hurrah! It'll be exciting. Lots of cool stuff will happen next time, I'm sure. Oh, what the hell are those? Whoa! Whoa! Those are OP looking. I will totally not use them at all. At all. Not at all. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Tomorrow we finish story. And then we see how long it takes to get through whatever else we gotta do. We might finish this game tomorrow. Maybe. We'll finish this game tomorrow, right? I believe in my ability to finish this game tomorrow. It depends on what they want me to do. Depends on what other stuff you want me to do. Probably fully upgrade everything. That's tip. That's pretty standard. Complete all quests is guaranteed. I'm actually kind of running out of those. That's a surprise. There's only 27 more. And then that should be it, right? That's no video games for today! I won't finish tomorrow, but you will. Oh. Uh, good? I think? 
Maybe? Came kind of late. You did. It's been over five hours. I'll be back with this game again tomorrow. And we'll finish story and then do as much post-game stuff as we can. We'll see, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. That was another hippin', hoppin', and boppin', poppin' stream though. It was very cool, very profile, very awesome. Very woohoo! Thanks for hanging out, cat! Thanks for hanging out, Dolby, and all the stamps. Hey, bye. I'm gonna go to sleep now. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Everybody who stopped by tonight. You all take care of yourselves, okay? Boss workers, everybody. I will be back tomorrow to finish this game. I will show this game. Who is in charge around here? And we'll totally start at a reasonable time. Sleeping cats for a moment? That's right. Why you cry, Dolby? We finishing this game tomorrow. Be excited. Whoosh. Whoosh. Good night. Sleep tight. No bed bugs. All that good stuff. Bye.